<laughs> Say that again. <laughs> and this is with no weed. <laughs> That's true. And then I also want to talk about what's your favorite piece of girl? Like what's, what you love working with in the studio? Like I'm talking about from the microphone down to the preamp. Um, what we talking about? No, you avoided something, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> really, they got old RCA ripping mics and shit. But uh, yeah, but U87s is cool. That's like for, or I actually like 414s. Akai, I'm not AKG 414s because them shits work pretty much for every situation you got. Man. And coming through like an Avalon mic pre and you know need compression and stuff like that. But that's like on some studio shit. But I'm like, you can make hit records. Like, I use the M-Box at home with, I used to have, a, like, a whole summit rack and all of this stuff, but I just don't even, I just go right through the pre and just use plugins, and it tends to work. Mm, yeah. yeah. Like, I, I got, I got, I did a dance record last year that hit Billboard Twitter, number 16 on Billboard, and I did that shit literally while my wife was watching TV. She's like, what's all that damn noise you making over there? I'm like, yeah, yeah, <laughs> Billboard, da -da, look at this shit. <laughs> but I'm like, you know, and then I ain't gonna lie, I got friends in high places. If I fuck my mixes up, I send them shits right to them Grammy motherfuckers. I mean, how you feel to be at home with somebody that got plaques and all? You know, like, you get you, you're, I'm so used to it. Like I, it's almost <laughs> like I grew up with, with uh, all of these hip hop big hits coming to my house, and it's like, right. oh hey, what's right. up? You know, right. hey Houdini, how you doing? Like, <laughs> and inside you're like, oh my god, oh my god, right, oh my right, god. Right. <laughs> Yeah, we did um all the time. It's like back right. in the day, like Jennifer Lopez sessions or like uh yeah. like Alicia Keys has held her son, our son. Yeah. It's like yo, I gotta go to the bathroom, hold him. <laughs> yeah, I'm saying and then studio quad uh, quad studios in New York is the studio like with a famous Biggie yeah, Tupac yeah, thing. Shot, yeah. We actually used to record in that room and what there is they have a, a hidden wall where there's a bedroom in there. So when my son was like, you know, infant and my wife allowed me to come into sessions and shit, and I wouldn't come home all that, that night, you know, the interns or whatever, and sometimes the artists, like, you know, like a Mariah or whatever, they'd be like, ooh, your baby's cute, let me take him into the room. I was like, oh, God bless you. Oh, have you ever done anything with Shanti? With Shanti? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, baby. Hey, Shanti. Hey, baby. <laughs> yeah, um, uh, <laughs> sh shout out to my man, Jeff Christie. You yeah. called it up. Yeah. Um, matter of fact, we kind of, we did all the demos that actually got her her deal. Oh, okay. Yeah, I mean, that, that, that's a little bit saucy, but I mean, but we right. understand. That's just how the, the music business is. It's right. like, you make hot shit for artists, and then somebody got a million dollars in their pocket, hear your shit, and it's like, okay. I was I'm gonna go back. Hustling out of Grand Marquis Caprice. People always told me I wasn't gonna be shit. But I always knew that I would be shit.